Hey YouTube, uh, this is Sun Jupiter here. I'm here to do a little tutorial, if you will, about how to use ScreenFlow. Um, I had a question from or a request um, on how to uh, do picture in picture, um, what kind of programs I use, stuff like that. So, right now I'm recording my screen with uh, QuickTime. I think it's QuickTime 10. It comes with uh, Snow Leopard. Right now I'm running 10.6 uh, Snow Leopard. Uh, it's the developer's uh, build from um, WWDC09. Um, so uh, that's what I'm running. I'll show you right now. See 10.6 right now on my um, 2.4 Intel Core 2 Duo uh, with 3 gigs of RAM. Alrighty, so let's get started. So the main program I use is ScreenFlow. So we are going to just do a recording with ScreenFlow and then show everybody how to do a picture in picture. Okay, so just wait for it to load up. So right now it's recording. Hello everybody, this is what I look like. Um, yeah, so we'll just end it right here. Uh-oh. <laughs> Internal feature again. Okay, we're gonna make it quick. Really quick. So hey YouTube, this is Sun Jupiter. And then stop it. And there we go. So from here, you from here you'll you're able to move around your your video you can rotate it a little bit like so and you can do the background as well you can make it smaller but it's dragging the edges and you can do the same thing on rotating it also and I'm rotating the uh, Y axis uh, rotation there so you can either put it there or there or you can add a uh, a third or fourth video clip to it if you wanted to so you'd go to uh, media and then you would go to add media here just saying you had another video clip somewhere and let's grab that one and just put it on there right so now you would drag it all the way down here like anywhere here that's good Just wait for it to load up. Or it should load up. <clears throat> well, I guess it's not loading up. There. There we go. There we go, and there it puts it right up in there. So pretty much all you gotta do is just proceed position your uh, video that's all you gotta do like make it small if you want this to be a big window you can do that I don't know everything about screen flow but this is what I know from screen flow this is what I use for all my videos so pretty much you can go like so and then you can add as many uh, video streams as you want but you gotta just make sure everything works out in the end right so and for each stream you could uh, like turn down the volume on one stream if you just want to use one audio source you could turn it up and down you just gotta select the clip that you need saying you want this clip muted you just go drag it all the way to zero and it's muted all this stuff I haven't figured out yet I never add text from ScreenFlow, I always add it to our uh, from uh, iMovie. So that's pretty much how you do it. You just make your main recording with ScreenFlow, and then after that, then you uh, just add videos in and position everything the way you want it to be positioned. Okay, so and for exporting, you'd go to export. Uh, you'd go 
here where it says scale by I always do 75% and then I go into customize and then I go to uh, what was that settings <laughs> and in here I can't remember who but they said uh, to have it at 5,000 so I always have mine at 5,000 the best video quality there just leave it here current frame automatic and then just hit OK the size it has to be HD 1280 by 720 uh, 16 by 9 this and this is the same thing you would think but no to get the HD tag um, from uh, YouTube it needs to be this one so you select it and then hit OK and then boom and then export and then it will save and then if you need to import it into iMovie uh, you can do so and and from there you can upload it to YouTube because that's what I do and I will show you here right now I just uploaded uh, two videos one was a redo because I uh, one of my titles were, was wrong so I had to fix that so these are all my videos there's some videos that are not shown here because I reformatted So yeah, I haven't even uploaded this movie, this one yet at all. I don't think I will. So yeah, this is all my projects I have there. All of them here. I just uploaded my Mac Mini review. I tried to make it short, and it was it was only seven minutes and change. And then the, okay, all right. So and there's other you know settings you could do to your uh, video from here you can add the text that's what I add the text from here so you just pick from which one you want to use and then your you know, transitions and stuff like that okay so yeah so if you if you want you can go and find the developers preview on the internet can't tell you where but it's there if you search for it so if you search you will find simple as that but I can't give you where it is sorry about that okay so uh, hopefully this video helps if uh, if it does let me know if not tell me what you you guys need me to do or to you know focus on and I'll do that all right this has been Sun Jupiter uh, don't forget to rate comment and subscribe Catch you guys later.